Hi guys, uh, here's another video for the Black Powder Challenge and I uh, finally managed to get my uh, Scots Grays painted up uh, It took me a while uh, Yeah, it's just, you know what like it is with work and other things So about this weekend I managed to bash home with them and, and, and get them finished and got them based up uh, We got the bases done yesterday So the only thing I've left to do is just to give them a, a spray of matte, matte varnish and, and that'll be them all done so I thought I'd just give you a look and, and see the finished unit figures. <coughs> Excuse me. So here we go. You've seen the front rank here. Got the officer converted guide and bearer because uh, you don't get one in the command pack. And <coughs> well, most cover is which is the kind of guidance anyway in, into battle. But I thought we'd make a nice little conversion adding that to banner. Says I think it's the only unit so far in the British British cover unit that I actually have a. A standard slash guiding so uh, yeah it makes a nice change so and uh, the other uh, thing on the front the command is the trumpeter there I'm just going to turn around so what I've done with this unit as well I've done uh, yeah but three just just for a variation of figures three the, the charging figures with the swords raised and uh, at the back the back row there we have the shouldered swords and uh, it, it was just so that, that I could buy a pack of each of the it was just a nice mix, rather than have them all the same. So, that's them guys, we'll get that turned around from the other side there. And uh, as I said, with the grey horses, I could, I was going to make them lighter, but I, I've just went with the, the real grey colour. And uh, just to give it a bit of variation, there's three different sort of shades of grey. See the dark, really dark one at the back there. Yeah. Going to next slightly lighter in the middle and then the lightest one at the front so that there's three of each in the unit <coughs> use me just to mix it up a bit there's you from the back there yeah said yeah i think once i got about halfway through with these guys i really started to enjoy it beginning with the with the well i, I always paint from a black undercoat <coughs> And yeah, it took a while for the, the colours to actually start popping out and it was a bit of a slog to begin with, they were quite dull and <laughs> bland looking but uh, once I started getting the highlights on and the brighter colours coming through uh, yeah, I really, I really enjoyed it so yeah, and as I say again, I think it just made a nice addition having the guy with the, the guide and bearer as well uh, and by the way, that guide, that, that's from GMB Designs which I normally buy all my flags from and uh, yeah so that's it guys another another addition to Winterpolar at Range and another video for the Black Powder Challenge and uh, I have been watching all you guys videos great stuff really enjoying it uh, yeah I just wish I could get some more figures painted <laughs> uh, but yeah you know Time allows, we can do what we know we can do. But uh, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to do next. I'll have a look through some figures. And I'm going to do another little video. Uh, yeah, <coughs> it was something that I got for my birthday present just uh, a few weeks ago. So I haven't actually really un unboxed the thing. But uh, yeah, I'll do a video on that when I get around there. Having a chance to actually get around and get getting stuck into it and having a good look. And uh, let you see what it is. And uh, right, okay, and guys, we shall see you all later. And uh, I say next time I'll, I'll post that video with the the birthday goodies. Right, okay, enjoy the hobby. Cheers, bye bye.